Do you hate bras? It's a little tight up here around my neck, but I mean, I'm used to that. Well, if you don't, I do. That's why today we are going to be reviewing the world's most comfy lifting bandeau. Because you know I can't just put these boobies in just anything. So stay tuned to find out if the ice silk bandeau is going to be getting a Brit Brat crown or if it's going to be getting clowned. I'm Brit Brat, your review queen, and today we are going to be reviewing and trying on the ice silk Bandeau bra. Our ice silk lifting bandeau is the most stylish yet comfortable lingerie that you must have in your summer wardrobe. Well, before we get started, shout out to my brass squad. You guys are amazing. And I have a question for you all today. What is your go-to comfy bra? Let me know in the comment section below. So if you guys don't know, the ice silk bra is supposed to be able to be a comfy bandeau that lifts and also just supports everything going on throughout the day. So you can wear your t-shirts, and you can wear your tank tops without worrying about tugging and putting up your bra all day long. And I must say, you guys, this thing is starting off real bad because I had to wait forever for this thing to come. And also, it looks nothing like it's supposed to. This is what it's supposed to look like right here. And this is what mine looks like. <laughs> so let's not beat around the bush and waste time, you guys. This is already underwhelming because the packaging, as you guys can see, was nothing. So it didn't come special. That's why I'm holding it in my hands right here. Um, it looks like it is a polyester spandex type blend. It doesn't tell you because in the inside, it just tells you some that it's extra large. So it just gives you the size. That's about it in the inside. But yeah, if I had to say this material it was, that's what I would guess. Um, this is what it looks like. So we do have some perforated little holes. As you guys can see, they're very, very tiny, but it's all throughout the whole bandeau. And then on the back, you are able to adjust, which is nice, I will say, because I've never had a bandeau. Actually, I don't own too many bandeaus that are strapless. I don't think I own any because I never can keep them on and they're just not comfortable because I always end up like, like it's a strapless bra. Same thing goes with bandeaus for me. They always just fall down. So hopefully, maybe it'll work. Um, but yeah, you can adjust it, which I think is really cool, like a bra. So it's got the three different levels. I think I'm probably going to end up going on the first one because it looks like it's a little bit tight like does this look like an extra large but it does come in small medium large and extra large I'm a 38 double D for those of you who are wondering and you guys really love my bra reviews hence the reason that I want to do this one for you guys it really helps you all out if you haven't checked out my most popular bra review I'll make sure that I link it up here for you guys so you can watch that after this one so enough is enough let's try this baby on and I do want to just add that it came with these plastic little straps like see-through ones it wasn't supposed to, but it did. And they do look like they fit right here on the little loops. So I guess that's a nice touch if you want to have to wear a strap, but I don't know why you would want to. When well, it's supposed to be a bandeau and it's supposed to be comfortable. So I'm just going to get rid of those. <laughs> you guys, this is ridiculous right now. Honestly, I feel like this is just a nipple cover. I don't know if you guys can see, but it has a stupid pad in here. Like, I don't know if they're connected or if it's just like one for each boob, but honestly, it just, it's making it go down on top of, I just hate pads on any type of bra that I have, whether it's a sports bra, a regular bra, any of them, I usually take them out. So I'm going to try to see if I can actually take them out from this one. Hopefully it makes this look better, but right now, mm, <laughs> be right back. So this is the pad that was inside, guys. Look at this. It was connected, which already to me is like a little stupid because usually when they have pads, bras or bandos they're like one each so yeah this was really weird made it really funny shaped here it gives you some sort of push right here i don't even think that this is a pad like this isn't going to give you anything so i don't know what they were doing and i ordered an extra large like whose extra large boob is this gonna cover honestly this feels like it's a toy bra all right guys so here's the bra with the pads out and honestly like this is just it's just bad. Like, you can see my just skin, the fat just hanging out. Like, it's ridiculous. It's just making them look like they're just going down. You know what I mean? Like, they're sad. And I feel like I... They're not that sad. But if you looked it up, maybe it would do a little something. But it just it won't stay. All right. Look, look, you guys. Just go ahead and give me my Brit Brat Clown. Because, honestly, I'm not even going to waste your time. This is awful. I not only had to wait months 
for this thing to get here. Not days, not weeks, months, you guys. I ordered this thing all the way back in March and it's just now getting here. But it does not look the way it's supposed to look and also it does not fit the way it's supposed to fit. This is the worst materialistic thing I've ever ordered. Look at it. Like, honestly, I just feel like it's a panel of cloth that just goes straight across. It's not doing anything for me. It keeps flopping down. I'm over it. And I don't want to have it on anymore. So, yeah, this is going to be getting a clown today. I would send it back, but I probably wouldn't even hear from the company. I wouldn't get any type of money back at all. And I don't even know if it's a real company at this point. This is just awful. This thing was $18.00. In a few cents, I don't even remember. It was 18. Let's just say 19 to round it off, but it's definitely not even worth that. So yeah, um, here's the Air Silk Bandeau Bra. Is it the world's most comfiest? No, it is not. So does it give you lift? No, it does not. And when you have a new bra size, by the time that it shows up, then probably. Honestly, I feel like my boobs need some redemption. That's better. If you guys enjoyed this review, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. If you would like for me to become your review queen throughout the week, make sure you hit that big old subscribe button and that bell so you'll be notified every single time that I upload a video. Go follow me on all of my social medias. That's Instagram and TikTok. And I'll be talking to you guys again with another honest review. I love you. Mwah. Bye, brats.